Hey, down here. Okay. Got the back door open because his dryer was running, making it hot in here. But I'm going to do one more thing on my white Westinghouse dryer and I'll be done. I've got, I've, I, the last time I got, you know, I made sure it run. I ran a load of few, four, three uh, floor mats out of it, through it, washed them and dried them. Uh, there's one of them, two of those little ones and then a big one. They're all wore out and that's why they're on the chair. And the back door's open so you can hear the highway, but I said, let's see. Oh, let's move this camera over here. Um, okay, so right now, it's uh, I can't tell what's what. Everything's backwards to me. Okay, there we go. Now I can kind of see what's going on. There. Yeah, the wobbly tripod. Okay, uh, I got up. I slept for 24 hours. I was so worn out. And when I got up, um, I don't know, 1.30 in the afternoon, 12.30, I was not well. I was still not well enough to do anything uh, until it's about, I don't know what it is. I think it's almost 6. I was thinking to get dark at 5.30, but anyway, to do this, I really wanted some light. I don't think I'm going to have any. But what I'm doing right now, I thought I'd just go ahead and show it. I've got this uh, endoscope camera. You can see it all. It's a very, very stiff cable that you can stick, you know, through things. And it's close-up only, you know. It's called an endoscope. And uh, if you doctors use them, if you may have, <laughs> this is not the, the the medical quality. <laughs> they say that on it. It's not a medical device. Don't use it for medical. Say that when you on the stuff when you bought it. But. Uh, Anyway, I had an allergy doctor using one on my nose one time years ago, so I I knew uh, what they were. And then they started becoming available. And see, this USB is so big and sticking out so far. Last thing I want is to break my USB port. It's kind of wobbly and bulk too. I tried it in two different ports on this laptop. This is an old Dell 6000, and I tried it out in the house the other day. The, the last day I worked on it, I tried to uh, go ahead and get it set up and come back out here that day, but I was so worried out. I, I, got, I didn't know what I was doing anymore, so I had to just quit and go to bed. And so uh, it will work, but you can't. If you try to record with audio, it it just free, you don't get any. The video freezes. Uh, it's only a 1.6 gigahertz pin, uh, uh, Celeron, and uh, it's actually running all the time as my server right now. So, but what I'm going to do is uh, <coughs> trying to get things out of the way here. What I'm going to do is uh, this is running the Bang Linux. That's why, it, well, it, it came with XP on it. It runs XP fine where it used to. But uh, it actually still has a messed up version of XP still on it. It's got a dual boot setup on it, but I need to just take it off. Uh, it got viruses, and it was like that when I got it, and then later on it got viruses again, and I hardly even used it. But. Uh, yeah, I'd like to shut the door. Well, I know the, the mic does pretty good about cutting out the car noise, but yeah, I think I'll shut it because it's bugging me it's so loud. I guess this is, yeah, this is a weekday, so everybody's still coming home from work. That's what it is. Oh, that light. I need, oh, when I taped up the button for the light and it's on. I need it on, but it'll use a lot of battery. I don't have it plugged in to the uh, power adapter. I was trying to hurry. I guess it doesn't matter now because I don't have to hurry now. I just do what I need to do. I mean, I mean, need to go get the power adapter. Let me see what the battery says. Let's see. Oh, I didn't get the mouse. I can't hardly control these things without the mouse. Oh, the screen's going to go dim because it's not plugged in, too. Ninety-eight percent right now, so it's fine. <sighs> I don't even really know how to use 
I always just use a regular mouse, but the, I have to have access to the, uh, see there's a light and it, it, it makes, if you leave it on full blast, not only does it use a lot of power, but uh, it uh, gets so hot you can't touch it. I think that cover might be loose. I think it's a screw on cover, although I don't work on this. Oh no, it's supposed to have that wide gap. There's clips that you can put on there. They're kind of about like a mic clip, you know, for a lapel. Yeah, I make noise on the lapel. Sounds like a good idea. Um, and uh, put that on there. I had a feeling I should check before I tape that up like that. Now I know why. Let's see which side has the... Uh, because I, I taped over the adjustment for the uh, light. Which side is it on? Other side? Yep. <laughs> but I wanted this, this stick. You know, I taped that stick on there to make that sturdy. There it is. So, uh, I'm going to cut it off to where I can get to the light. Adjustment. Let's see. Yeah, it's so close to the back end, there's no point in having any of that there. Okay. Let it stick off for a minute, but hang on to that. Put my arm through it. Let's see. Yeah. Don't really need that. To... Well, I guess it's good to have some of it on the wire. The wire needs strain relief too. It doesn't have good strain relief on the wiring, and that was one complaint I saw about them before I bought this one. So I have always uh, tried to be real careful about straining the wires. Well, and twisting, just don't twist it is my my idea. I'm just going to put this extra piece around that. I don't know that it'll help. Well, it may help some. So, that, yeah, that'll keep me from breaking my USB. Now, I can turn this off. There we go. Turn it all the way on. Where is it in the picture? There it is. All the way off. And, and I'm going to need it to see up. Uh, did I say I'm going to use it to look up in the vent pipe? That's my plan. To see if it's clogged up, if it's got bird nest or something in it. Before I know it works good with it off, so before I put it on, I want to make sure that is not clogged up because that would have been what ruined the other heating element. Uh, I didn't even really check that my. Let me see if yeah, I didn't double check if my uh, mic was working if the Bluetooth was working. So uh, yeah, I, I'll. Well, I'll know, I guess, well, see, I was going to, the only way I could show it on the video was to have this in the, in the shot, and, but it's going to dim down, so I guess i got to go get the power supply. So before I open up the app, which will work it real hard, I'll get that. It'd probably run the battery down in 10 minutes anyway, like that. So, uh, you're just going to have to run off camera and go get it. <clears throat> or should I, no, I would, I would just go ahead and do it, but it's going to dim every time I, see, every time I, it just takes like five minutes. It's, I think that's how I got it set to dim so not run down the battery. I'll be back. Oh. I didn't feel like doing it earlier. But I didn't feel like doing it.
Oh, okay. Uh, let's see if my Bluetooth hooks back up. I have the loads about half dry that's in there. Yep, seems to be working. And, uh, yeah, where am I going to plug it in? I guess over here. Yeah, if I unplug the, yeah, I'll unplug this thing over by the washer. Oh, it doesn't plug in there. Okay. Got to have an adapter. I guess I'll take the. I'm going to have to unplug the washer for a little bit. Because it's got an adapter for three prong to two. Our house is only wired with two, two wires. And that's all this thing needs. Uh, well, this one has got a three prong. This laptop adapter does. Power supply. Where's it going to go? I don't know if that's going to be... That won't really get me there. It's too far away. Well, of course. Okay. We'll try something different. Ugh. Boy, that's hard to get off. I guess that's a good one in that case because you don't want that one falling off. I used to have that. Well, that stays good. I thought I used to have that screw. And that was one of those with a tab where you can put the screw through it, the one that holds the cover plate on. And I thought I had it um, mounted like that, but it's not. All right. Uh, maybe if I go get... Oh, no, it has to be a three-way. Well, I don't need the heater on. This might reach. I am using... I've got a nice big 30 amp cord that holds stuff really well. Uh, over here that the heater plugs into and it has three, three more connections that we really don't use much. But... Uh, So if I unplug the heater, I got room for the and the heater. I unplugged it. It was running and it's it was 71 degrees outside today. I missed a, I missed a beautiful day from wearing myself out and working at night. For, everything is in a bad place uh, to where it can get. Now that was me rolling the chair around banging into that I knew I was doing it and I just kept going that's the way I am okay now yeah everything's gonna be to where I can trip over it real easy but at least it'll reach okay now uh, I have to pull the dryer out and let's see, I guess I'll shut this. I think it'll go to sleep. I have to pull the dryer out. And uh, it's already full of clothes and then that big old box on there. Um, I don't, the ground is what I want to show, so let's make sure that's what we see. Well... Try to remember to run the camera today for a little, you know, show what I'm doing. Okay. Uh, a couple of times during all those videos I made, I forgot, I had the camera pointing down in the garage. And uh, I was up here working on this. So, now I've got all kinds of stuff over here on the, uh, on the washer, but I can move that stuff. up against it here stop wobbling okay I think I put my tools right here and hopefully none of them will slide up in there to where I can't well we'll slide some of them up in there oops is that a good place or a bad place I don't know yet Okay. <coughs> Water. Yeah. Whoops. I 
know if I left that laying there. It's a twisty that I've been using to on the wires. I, I use it to coil up that. <coughs> Guess I can put it in my pocket. I figured if I did, it would start bugging me. But yeah, well, I'm gonna be getting down on the floor, probably lay on the darn thing. Okay, so big box. <coughs> Put you over on the dryer. It's gonna be heavy up, heavy enough to move. That box is heavy all on its own. But the clothes, I've been, it's a big load. That I have worse, bigger loads, but that's close to about as big as. There's my little note saying uh, I'm gonna leave that off until I until I do something. Until I do this. Okay. Yeah, no, that's plugged in. I'm just not gonna unplug it just to do this. I don't think. How long is that cord? I'm really gonna have to unplug it. I can't move it hardly at all. Probably best to do that anyway. <clears throat> well, at least it moves easy. There we go. Now I can get. I can get around. I've got my mic cords hanging on stuff. It's really still pretty darn warm. Heater was running. I mean, the heater, well, the, the dryer heater was running, and it's just exhausting into here. But what my mic cords on my lapels, they're already getting hung on everything. I have a shirt to put on over it. That was working out, but it's cold. You know, I was working in that when it was cold. But let's do it. I could open the front door, I guess, get some cool air in here. I don't know, we'll see. If I start getting hot, I'll have to. Just as soon not have the door, front, big front door open with it. be some noise coming in that way too. Oh, and mosquitoes, that's right. We have mosquitoes in January, February. What is it, January or February now? It was 31st the other day, it must be February. I don't know how many days the month had in it. January. Okay. Uh, yeah, these these are my flannel shirts. I love these things. I don't go. I used to always wear them over my t-shirts when I would go out in cool weather. I don't go anywhere anymore. So they're most of them are like new. I really didn't want to work in in any of these, but. Really, only have one that's a good work shirt, and I was down to was down to my t-shirts that I don't want to wear because I ruined them with those darn. Uh, I don't know if they were what brand they were, but uh, I don't know if it was Tide or All. I like the All soap. It's no allergy soap, and this I've found the best way to get a you know best way you can, you know economical way to buy it but my mom discovered these ones i guess you saw them on tv these ones that are i think it's the same brand it could have been tied but they're called pods they're little bag little melting bags with soap in them and there's and uh she liked it and they're more i guess more well they're more convenient than you know getting it out of that thing and uh so we were using them for a while and i kind of would keep using that most of the time but then i started saying well why buy two different kinds and so i started using those and i run three of three or four of my black t-shirts because they say they're concentrated i didn't believe it till that happened uh, i think they tell you to put them in there and then fill the tub with water and then put your clothes on well who the heck has time for that uh, i would put them in there and try to make something sure something was old where that thing landed and i'd have the water running for a while i'd, I'd get some water in the tub but <clears throat> didn't work. It worked okay sometimes, but just enough times it didn't work okay. Some other things that did that too, bleached them out like that, uh, that I didn't care, you know, maybe certain spots on my shirts or something or down in where my tuck my shirt in or something, but some of them it ruined them right where you see them, where you wear them. So, laptop. All right, now I got to get the software up and going. Oh, I forgot to get the mouse. Oh, I really don't want to have the mouse, you know, fight with the mouse, do I? 
Yes, I have to. Okay, it's already getting really hot. I was already kind of hot. This thing, I have a feeling, is going to want to uh, just fall out when I move it around. Where's the hole where the power goes? There we go. Now, it'll stay. Power manager error. Okay, now it says it's charging. Thank you. Okay, so... Uh, Yeah, this thing does not do good with anything with a light on it, so you're probably not even going to see what I'm trying to do here, but we'll try it. I'm going to open the door, I guess. I don't want to sweat like a pig on such a beautiful evening. Okay, uh, so we'll open the door. Now, um, looking at the light, it's weird. Turn around the other way where I can't check it. I'm going to turn this tripod. That is not working for me. Let's see. Sorry. I'm going to get this uh, thing turned where I can see it. Woo! Fun. Okay. So if my I have my Bluetooth receiver. I couldn't see it with the keep crawling around back behind the tripod. So I usually try to remember to face it out front. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna have a drink of water here. Yeah, I wanted to just record on the t laptop with just this camera with audio, but I couldn't. So, didn't even. What you doing? My shoes. There you go. <laughs> you. You're welcome. Okay. Uh, yeah, I haven't got. There we go. I've got a cool little app search app. This is a. This is Mate Desktop. It's a. The Bane 8 Linux, Mate Desktop, my favorite desktop. And, but this is App Finder, XFCE App Finder. And you can find apps real quick that way. I, I, well, right now I'm in a weird... I couldn't even hardly read the little menu right now, the way I, where I'm at, you know. But uh, let's see if that camera is working. It looks like it's already frozen up. <clears throat> No, it's not froze up. It just there wasn't nothing going on. Okay, now you can see, maybe, if you can see anything. I don't know if you can. It's, uh, picture's upside down. This, you know, it's a round cable and a round camera, so you never know which way your picture's going to be. Oh, that was lucky. I got it turned right side up. Okay, so it's working, but if I, uh, start to record, it'll freeze up. So, uh, yeah, I can't drag and move things or do anything. Uh... With this mouse thingy, this pad. Is it recording? 